let's just do an update. Maybe I don't touch on it enough. All the charges now. Alex and Amorado facing now a total of 16 years. 16 years is the maximum penalty that all the charges carry. I don't know if you knew this or not, gente. Alex, he is not a citizen. I don't know. He might be what you call a naturalized American. So the prosecutors are also pursuing on top of the charges that span a maximum of 16 years. They're saying now on top of that. Guess who also is getting involved is INS because he's not a citizen. So as a non-citizen of the U.S., should have the feathers been ruffled that much? Is that like someone with warrants on the run, with warrants on the run, going in front of a cop's face? Is that the same thing or, or is that something different? I just want to know. I don't know. I'm going to leave that totally up to you guys. But the Victorville 8 have gotten a lot of attention and a lot of media. They've blown up. It's gone viral all over the place. And now that the 16 years max sentence is on top of his head and the, and the articles are circulating that he is not a U.S. resident and INS can get involved, I don't know if they can go from state to federal to INS. It's just there's so many components and factors to this, and a lot of people are rallying online, and I want to ask the Rasa, what does the Rasa think? think.